it right now. We trust that your spirit is moving on my brother. That your power is moving on my brother. God, because nobody can call spirits like you can. Nobody can bring us under subjection like you can. Nobody can sober us and put us on a path called straight like you can. The call that he rode to Damascus was knocked over his horse. And he was earnestly 
designed to be clothed upon with our house which is from heaven. Yeah. If so that being clothed we shall not be found naked. Mm -hmm. For we that are in this tabernacle do groan being burdened. Not for that we would be unclothed but clothed upon. Yeah. That mortality might be swallowed up of life. Yeah. Now he that hath wrought us for the self same thing is God who also have given unto us the earnest of the Spirit. Therefore, we are confident. Somebody say confident. confident. Knowing that whilst we are at home in the body, we are absent from the Lord. For we walk by faith, <laughs> not by sight. We are confident, I say, and willing rather to be absent from the body and to be present with the Lord. Yes. Wherefore we labor that whether present or absent, yes, we may be accepted of him. Yes. I want to look at verse number seven. For we walk by faith, by faith. Yeah. and not by Oh, my, my, my. <laughs> For we walk by faith and not by sight. Before you take your seat, I want you to look at your neighbor and just say, neighbor, oh neighbor, I choose to believe. I'm the wrong neighbor. You need to find me somebody else. And just say, neighbor, Christ. Amen. 
man. Hallelujah. I am righteous for I am right with God. Not because of anything I've done. Not because of any works I've worked. But I have been made right with God because I accepted his son, Jesus Christ. And it's important to know if you are a believer. Because God says, this is a year. Can I talk in here? He says, this is a year when you must walk totally on what you believe. Oh, somebody just missed what I just dropped in here. I said, God said, this is a year when you must walk totally on what you believe. God says in 2020, you got to walk by faith. Oh, y'all ain't saying nothing to me. God says in 2020, you got to walk by what you know rather than what you see. Hey, God have mercy. Pastor, how can you say, amen, glory to God, that this is a year that we're going to walk by faith? Because even right now, amen, the normal person will be distracted by what's going on in the sanctuary right now. But I choose to believe in Jesus. I choose to believe that this word has power, that this word is quick, this word is alive, this word is sharper than any two-edged sword. I believe in who God is. tell you that you cannot walk by circumstances and situations. God says you must walk by faith. You must walk a man outside of influence a man and your naysayers and you must walk by faith. Somebody shout faith. Amen. You got to walk a man by faith. Faith. You can't walk by broken promises and misunderstandings. You got to walk by faith. You can't walk off of what happened in 2019 and how you were hurt in 97 and how it didn't happen right in 2005 and how they broke you in 2007. God said right now as you enter into 2020, the only thing you need to take with you is faith in God. I don't know how it's going to happen, but I believe God. I don't know how it's going to turn around, but I believe God. I don't know how it's going to get better, but I believe God. I don't know how they're going to straighten it up, but in my sanctified soul, I believe God. Tell your neighbor, I believe God. I don't know what you believe. I can't worry about what you believe. I can't worry about what you say.
neighbor just say all things. All things. When you go home and people start talking crazy, don't argue with them in 2020. Just look that devil in the face and say all things. Don't you argue with nobody else about it. Come on. 
every now and then.
So they ain't gonna need us laboring with them. We didn't push them on the ground. We didn't even touch them. God brought them down. That's the kind of power I'm walking in. That's the kind of belief I'm believing in. I'm not giving the devil no room. The kingdom of God suffered violence. And the violence taken by this. The devil is taking over the church too long. He's ruled the church too long. He gave us power.
to be cast out of this man. Shumuni Havo, my little son of Jordi. Jordi, my
the over the over all week. The Bible says that the strong bear the infirmities of the weak. And so we can help carry you along. We can help carry you along. You need a pastor, someone that is praying for you. I said, you need a pastor, someone that's praying for you. I have alarms set all day because I'm a school teacher. When one thing ends and an alarm goes off to tell us to go to the next thing, but there's an alarm that I have that is a, the most precious to me. And it rings as soon as I get to work. And that alarm title is Pray for the Saints. So even though sometimes nothing may be going wrong with you, God impressed upon my heart, pray for the saints. You may be A-OK, -okay, but the devil may have a trap set around the corner. But I'm praying that God will reroute your steps. I'm praying that even if you have to go through the storm, he'll give you grace to go through it. Does anybody believe that with me today? Amen. 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 If not, if there's no one that would like to join the Rivers of Life family, the stewards are going to come at this time that we might be able to take up our offering in Jesus' name. song we like to sing around here. I'm living in the overflow. Anybody believe it? I said, does anybody believe it? Come on, stewards. Come in. Get you a good gift in your hand. stand with me. Once you have a nice gift in your hand, we're going to move all the way into 2019. Oh, 2020. I said we're going to move all the way into 2020. I said we're going to move all the way into 2020. Yeah. God, in the name of Jesus, that you will bless every hand that gave, bless the hands that will receive, that these monies might be used to the upkeep of your kingdom. Father, we're doing kingdom work, so we ask you, God, to give us the finances, give us wherever there's a prophecy, there is provision, and we believe it and decree it in Jesus' name. Give, and it shall be given unto you a good measure, pressed down, shaken together. Run it over, shall man give it to my bosom. In Jesus' name, amen. We're going to begin with my right, your left.
so much for your liberal giving. Amen. Thank you so much for your liberal giving. Amen. Thank you so much. Amen. A couple announcements before we groove out of here, y'all. Thank you so much for worshiping with us when we believe and we flow. If you believe on me, as the scriptures have said, then I'll be your belly. Shout for rivers of living water in Jesus' name. I'm living in the overflow. I'm living in the overflow. I'm living. 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 But my brother just said, with tears in his eyes, his power is real. He said, and I just want to ask you, Pastor, for one faith. Just give me a ride home. Cause I don't want to be on the streets tonight. Y'all hear me?
Sunday. Here every Sunday at 2 o'clock. 2 o'clock p.m. Meet us here. If you can't meet us here, meet us here. In Jesus' name. Every Tuesday night at 6 30, we're right here. The Bible study. We believe in Bible around here. Is God going to witness in here? Amen. Meet us here. Amen. Just want to tell you, amen, the next Tuesday we will resume with our Bible class. We took two weeks off. Amen. Because Christmas Eve and New Year's Eve fell. Amen. On Tuesdays. And so we postponed. But I got one last thing to tell y'all. Happy New Year. Amen. I think they got donuts. I think there's some sausage casserole back there. I think there's some butter, some butter cookies. I think they got all. I think there's some hot apple cider back there too. Amen. So God bless all the food. Amen. Bless the hands of the community. Sacred God in Jesus' name. God bless you. We love y'all. Good night. Hug somebody. Tell them no happy new year. And God bless you. I'm walking in belief. God bless you. We love you, Lord Jesus.